Welcome back to Nourish and Thrive. We're thrilled to have you with us today. This is your trusted source for boosting health and wellness. We aim to empower you with the knowledge and tools to lead a healthier, more vibrant life. Today, we're delving into a hidden danger. Microplastics. These tiny particles are more prevalent than you might think. They're everywhere, and they pose a significant threat to our health. From the water we drink to the air we breathe, microplastics have infiltrated our daily lives. But don't worry, there's a simple, natural solution. Fiber. Incorporating more fiber into your diet can help mitigate the effects of these harmful particles. Microplastics are minuscule pieces of plastic, often invisible to the naked eye. They can be as small as a few micrometers, making them difficult to detect. They come from the breakdown of larger plastic products like bottles and bags. Over time, these items degrade into smaller and smaller pieces. These particles linger in our environment, contaminating our water, air, and food. They have been found in the most remote corners of the earth, from the deepest oceans to the highest mountains. The insidious nature of microplastics lies in their size. Because they are so small, they can easily enter our bodies without us even realizing it. They're small enough to be ingested and inhaled, accumulating in our bodies over time. This accumulation can lead to various health issues, including inflammation and other chronic conditions. This buildup raises serious concerns about their long-term impact on our health. Scientists are still studying the full extent of the damage these particles can cause. We'll explore how these tiny particles get into our bodies and the potential risks they pose. Understanding the pathways of exposure is crucial for developing effective strategies to protect ourselves. But most importantly, we'll reveal how increasing your fiber intake can provide a natural defense against this pervasive threat. By making simple dietary changes, you can help your body expel these harmful particles more efficiently. Microplastics infiltrate our bodies through various pathways, often without us even realizing it. These tiny particles, less than 5 millimeters in size, are pervasive in our environment and can be found almost everywhere. One major route is through our food. From the moment we sit down to eat, we might be consuming microplastics without even knowing it. Seafood, in particular, is a significant source of microplastics. Fish and shellfish can ingest these particles, which then accumulate in their bodies. Fish and other marine animals often mistake these tiny particles for food, leading to their accumulation in the food chain. This means that when we consume seafood, we are also ingesting these microplastics. But it's not just seafood. Microplastics have been found in a wide range of other foods as well. Microplastics are found in our drinking water, both bottled and tap, as well as in other food sources like fruits, vegetables, and packaged goods. Studies have shown that even the water we drink daily can be contaminated with these particles. Even the air we breathe can contain microplastics, particularly in urban environments or near industrial areas. These particles can be inhaled and enter our respiratory system. Once inside our bodies, microplastics can wreak havoc on our systems. They can travel through our bloodstream and lodge in various organs. They can disrupt our hormones, trigger inflammation, and damage our cells. The presence of these particles can lead to a range of health issues, Emerging research suggests links between microplastic exposure and a range of health problems, including gut disorders, reproductive issues, and even certain types of cancer. As scientists continue to study the impact of microplastics, it becomes increasingly clear that these tiny particles pose a significant threat to human health. Fortunately, there's a natural way to combat this invisible enemy, fiber. Recent studies highlight the remarkable ability of dietary fiber to bind to microplastics in the gut, preventing their absorption into the bloodstream. Think of fiber as a microscopic broom, sweeping through your digestive system and collecting these harmful particles along the way. This binding action helps to trap microplastics, preventing them from being absorbed into your body's tissues and organs. Instead, they are safely excreted from your system, reducing their potential for harm. This research sheds light on the crucial role of fiber in protecting our health in an increasingly polluted world. By incorporating more fiber-rich foods into our diets, we can harness the power of nature to shield ourselves from the harmful effects of microplastic exposure. 
Fiber isn't a one-size-fits-all nutrient. It's a crucial component of our diet that comes in various forms, each playing a unique role in maintaining our health. It comes in two main types, soluble and insoluble fiber, each with its unique benefits. Understanding the difference between these fibers can help you make better dietary choices. Soluble fiber, found in foods like oats, beans, and apples, dissolves in water to form a gel-like substance in the gut. This gel-like substance plays a significant role in our digestive process. This gel helps slow down digestion, regulate blood sugar levels, and lower cholesterol. By slowing down digestion, it allows for a more gradual absorption of nutrients, which is beneficial for maintaining stable blood sugar levels. Insoluble fiber, found in foods like whole grains, nuts, and vegetables, doesn't dissolve in water. Instead, it passes through the digestive system relatively intact. Instead, it adds bulk to your stool, promoting regularity and preventing constipation. This type of fiber is essential for keeping things moving smoothly through your digestive tract. Both types of fiber are essential for a healthy gut and overall well-being. They work together to ensure that your digestive system functions efficiently. By enjoying a variety of fiber-rich foods, you can reap the benefits of both soluble and insoluble fiber. Including a mix of these fibers in your diet can help you achieve a balanced and nutritious diet. Aim to include both types in your diet to promote optimal digestion, support healthy blood sugar levels, and keep your gut functioning at its best. A well-balanced diet rich in both soluble and insoluble fiber can significantly contribute to your overall health and well-being. Embracing a high-fiber diet doesn't have to be bland or boring. A wide array of delicious and nutritious foods are packed with this essential nutrient. Fruits like berries, pears, and apples are excellent sources of fiber, providing a sweet and satisfying way to boost your intake. Vegetables, both leafy greens like spinach and kale and cruciferous veggies like broccoli and cauliflower are also fiber powerhouses. Legumes such as lentils, beans, and chickpeas are not only high in fiber, but also excellent sources of plant-based protein. Don't forget about whole grains like brown rice, quinoa, and oats. These grains retain their bran and germ, which are rich in fiber and other essential nutrients. Nuts and seeds like chia seeds, flax seeds, and almonds are also fantastic additions to a high-fiber diet. Increasing your fiber intake should be done gradually to avoid digestive discomfort. Start by adding a serving or two of fiber-rich foods to your diet each day. For example, add berries to your breakfast cereal or swap white rice for brown rice with dinner. Drink plenty of water throughout the day as fiber absorbs water in the digestive tract. Staying hydrated helps prevent constipation and promotes regular bowel movements. Experiment with different types of fiber-rich foods to find what you enjoy most. Don't be afraid to get creative in the kitchen. Add beans to soups and stews. Sprinkle nuts and seeds on salads or enjoy a piece of fruit for dessert. By incorporating these simple changes into your daily routine, you can easily boost your fiber intake and enjoy its protective benefits. While a high-fiber diet is a powerful tool, it's not the only way to reduce microplastic exposure. Minimizing your use of single-use plastics is crucial. Opt for reusable water bottles, shopping bags, and food containers. Filter your tap water to remove microplastics and other impurities. Choose natural fibers like cotton and wool over synthetic fabrics like polyester and nylon, which can release microplastics during washing. Be mindful of your seafood choices. Opt for smaller fish lower on the food chain as they tend to accumulate fewer microplastics. By making these conscious choices, you can significantly reduce your overall exposure to microplastics and protect your health. The fight against microplastic pollution requires collective action. By making conscious choices in our daily lives, we can protect ourselves and our planet. Embrace a high-fiber diet, reduce your plastic consumption, and spread awareness about this important issue. Together, we can make a difference. Remember, small changes can have a big impact. Let's work towards a healthier, more sustainable future for ourselves and generations to come. Thank you for joining us today on Nourish and Thrive. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more practical tips on improving your health and well-being. 
Stay tuned for our next video, where we'll explore another fascinating topic related to your health. Until then, stay informed, stay empowered, and stay healthy.